Story 18. The Divided Kingdom King David ruled for forty years. Then he died, and his son Solomon began to rule over Israel. God spoke to Solomon and asked him what he wanted most that God should do for him. Solomon asked that God would make him very wise. This pleased God, so he made Solomon the wisest man in the world. Solomon learned many things and was a very wise ruler. God also made him very wealthy. In Jerusalem, Solomon built the temple for which his father David had planned and gathered materials. People now worshipped God and offered sacrifices to him at the temple instead of at the tent of meeting. God came and was present in the temple, and he lived there with his people. But Solomon loved women from other countries. He disobeyed God by marrying many women, almost one thousand of them. Many of these women came from foreign countries and brought their gods with them and continued to worship them. When Solomon was old, he also worshipped their gods. God was angry with Solomon because of this. He said that he would punish him by dividing the nation of Israel into two kingdoms. He would do this after Solomon died. After Solomon died, his son Rehoboam became king. All the people of the nation of Israel came together to accept him as their king. They complained to Rehoboam that Solomon had made them do a lot of hard work 